Hi, boys and girls. Look where I am. I'm in the classroom. It's just me, but I'm going to read you the book Chicken Little, and this is a fun one. It says, Chicken Little was not the brightest chicken in the coop. He was very excitable and prone to foolishness. One day, he was going, or he was doing nothing, his usual pastime, when an acorn fell from the sky and hit him on the head. Boink, ah, he says. It knocked him senseless. Oh my goodness, oh my gracious, he exclaimed. The sky is falling, the sky is falling. I must run for my life. He grabbed his umbrella to protect his scrambled noggin and ran out into the world without much of a plan. Here he goes. It was not long before he bumped into Henny Penny. Boink! Ah! They really ran into each other. Where are you going in such a rush? She squawked. Oh my goodness! Oh my gracious! Chicken Little panted. The sky is falling! The sky is falling! We must run for our lives! Oh my! Said Henny Penny and, began, and being witless herself joined in without any further questions. And off they ran. Still no plan though. Within minutes, they ran into Lucky Ducky. Boink, ah! He haste, he squawked. Why are you in such a hurry? Oh my goodness, oh my gracious, huffed Chicken Little. The sky is falling and we are running for our lives. Henny Penny could not catch her breath, so she said nothing. Not wanting to be left out, Ducky Lucky joined in and off they ran and still no plan. Momentarily, they ran into Lucy Goosey. Honestly, with these names, it is no wonder they didn't know what they were doing. Boink, onk. Why don't you watch where you're going, she honked. Oh my goodness, oh my gracious, Rats, Chicken Little. The sky is falling and we are running for our lives. What a bother, I'd, I'd better come with you. What's the plan, asked the goose. No time for a plan, she, they puffed. The sky is falling and off they ran. So still no plan. As it was growing dark, they ran into Turkey Lurkey. Boink up! Look at him flying there. Hey, how dare you, he gobbled. Oh my goodness, oh my gracious, croaked Chicken Little. The sky is falling and we are running for our lives. No time to explain. And off they ran. Boink, ack, ah, ee, boink. Oh my goodness, are they making lots of noises? Yeah. Soon, the, the anxious little flock grew tired. They were not used to all this running. Then they ran into Foxy Loxy. There's his nose. Oh boy. My, my, rumbled the fox. Where are these little birds going in such a frantic pace? Oh my goodness! Oh my gracious! gasped Chicken Little, who was not quite was who was now quite out of breath. The sky is falling, and we are running for our lives! Oh my goodness! Indeed, said the fox. We must find a place for you to rest. Step into my in this warm, dark cave where the sky cannot fall on you. Without another thought in their tired feathered heads, the flock went toward or forward grateful, gratefully into the warm, dark cave. Boys and girls, do you think that's a good idea? They think that's a cave, but what is it really? Shoo, squawked the hen. It stinks in here. And the floor is squishy and wet, quacked the duck. Uh-oh, gobbled the turkey. Oh no, honked the goose. Do you think they're realizing where they're at? And they said, ah, 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 choo! And all of them went flying out. Ah. 
And then they ran away from the fox as fast as they could because they realized where they were, right, boys and girls? I hope you liked that story. It was fun to read in the classroom. And now we'll show you the little activity. Hi, boys and girls. Here's all the fun projects you can do. There's Henny Penny. There's Goosey Lucy. There's Chicken Little. Turkey Lurkey. Lucky Ducky. And of course, Foxy Loxy. So you have a lot of construction paper in there and you can make any one of these characters. All you have to do is pause the video and take a look at them and make one of them all on your own and do a great job. And if you do, take a picture and send it to Miss Ackerman or Mrs. Obenrader. Have a great day.